So here we have first problem from chapter 13. So 50 turn coil has diameter. Mm -hmm. The coil is placed in sp specially uniform magnetic field of magnitude of 11.7 Tesla. So that the face of the coil and magnetic field are perpendicular. Mm -hmm. Find the magnitude of the EMF induced in the coil if the magnetic field is reduced to zero uniformly in one second. Okay, um, so basically, it is a coil. Uh, so it's like this coil, and it has number of turns. Fifty. It has a diameter of the coil, which is fifteen centimeter. Uh, magnetic field was B final was zero and B initial was 11.7 Tesla. Mm -hmm. Then find the EMF. We have to find EMF uh, when uh, T initial was zero second and t final was one second okay so how can we find it the first of all we know that induced emf in the coil is basically equal to the uh, negative number of turns magnetic flux df over dt okay the magnetic fields uh, flux itself is equal dba so magnetic field times area and divide by dt. Now since number of turns and area is a constant, we can write it down as a negative number of turns area dB over dt. Of course you can also write down cosine theta, but it's going to be one. Uh, so we don't want to write it down. So the finally then uh, it's equal uh, number of turns let's keep it still there and area is uh, pi r square okay or you can write it down that area is equal uh, diameter over 2 okay you can write it down later on so db over dt or pi number of turns so don't forget the negative signs are still and d squared over 4 db over dt okay then uh, we finally come to the number of turns pi d squared over 4 uh, that becomes b final minus b initial and time final minus time initial uh, so b initial <laughs> B initial is 11.7, B final becomes 0, T final is 1 second, T initial is 0 second, okay? So, if you plug the numbers, you should get the answer.